Chris, how do you look back at that? Yeah, I think it was. Uh, I think we started off well. You know, got the goal. Um, I think to be fair, we had the dominated all first 45 minutes. And I think second half we come out, come out the blocks. I think goals changed games once they got that goal. Um, then they got the second goal on the break. It was a bit like you know, don't want to win, uh, lose three on a row. And it, I'm not gonna lie, would have hurt if we'd lost today. So I think that goal at the end really it was a big, could be a little turning point for us at the moment. And. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, in terms of the performance, there seemed to be a, a sense there of determination to put things right because obviously Tuesday night you went one 0 up against Wimbledon before losing that game. Yeah, exactly. And I'm not going to say that was probably going through our minds a bit. Um, I think we, we showed good character. You know, we worked hard, kept going to the 93rd minute, not to the end, and almost got a winner as well. And the character, of course, uh, reflected itself in the fact you scored so late on. Just tell us about that goal. Yeah, I just I think um, it, was, it was a I think it was a corner. And uh, someone's head back, and I just swung my big leg round <laughs> and got good contact and went in. It was similar to, to Minter's goal first half, and I just kept putting the ball in the, in the box. And the pitch is quite hard to play at the moment, so we've just got to play percentages, keep turning them, you know, play to our strengths and wear, wear teams down at the moment. And it's secured a point. How big is that point, do you think, when you look at the other results today? Yeah, I've, I've, I think a couple of results have gone our way. Um, like I said, it stops the rot now, and uh, we've got a big game Tuesday, and I think we can get some more points on the board. Uh, you know, we've got games in hand as well. Ideally, we'd rather have the points in the games, but you know, it's out of our hands, and uh, we've just got to get, get, get on the run now, really. And it's Fleetwood at home on Tuesday, another team we're pushing for the playoff place. Yeah, we seem to do well against the teams at the top at the moment, so uh, I think, I think, I don't know why that is, I think teams that probably lower down the league come here and, you know, make it hard for us and uh, find it hard to break them down, but I think today they come at, come at us today and it suited us, to be honest, and uh, I think it was a good point. You talk about teams coming at you thick and fast. Mm. For you as players, how difficult is this period? Because obviously it's a very busy schedule for you. Yeah, so I mean, we've got good squad at the moment, you know, I think uh, lot, everyone's almost fit as well, so... Uh, and like I say, we've got a lot of games coming up, uh, and there's no hiding place at the moment. Do you know what I mean? We played five games in a row at home, and uh, I think we're making a pitch. We're getting used to the pitch, and we're making an advantage for us at the moment, and just you know, to keep turning teams and, 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 and uh, chasing down defenders and, and making it awkward for them. And there's no let up in the schedule, is it? Today's game was the first of nine games in March. Yeah. yeah. How sort of key do you think in terms of the rest of the season for this month now? Be? It's just momentum, really. There's a lot of points we played. You know, thick and fast. If we can get on a good run now, you know, we can push through to the playoffs, I'm sure of that. Shush.